You sure you're at the right party? This is a celebration for the Saints, is it not? Business with Marshall is less lucrative than it used to be. I was hoping your bosses would be interested in a new partnership.
They're in there. I'd knock if I were you. Hello? It's Antonio Espina. <clears throat> Look, I, I know that we don't have the best history, but I was thinking, hoping, really, that we could work something out.
What should I do first? When can you start? Welcome to the team. What a beautiful day to be me. Damn, this place is coming along nicely. What's going on here today? It's good to be home. Time to saddle on up. Time to hit the dusty trail. Getting swanky. You've joined something big here. I think I'm ready for some action. Antonio, glad you came to your senses. Hey, I'm kind of having a party right now, but we'll talk business later. We got a party going on, so I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet. Fuck the Panteros. Fuck the idols. Fuck Marshall. The Saints are here to stay, baby. So, if you know how to shoot a gun, or if you're broke and want to learn how, swing by the church. We'll be waiting for you. Why? Hello, and welcome to Marshall Defense Industries. You know it wasn't easy getting here. Your journey began with one of the most unforgiving job interviews we could devise. But you did more than just survive a few live fire exercises. You excelled, and in doing so, proved that you were Marshall material. But don't take my word for it. Hear it from the man himself. Hello, I'm Atticus Marshall. And I wanted to personally welcome you to the Marshall family. Here at MDI, we don't just make a profit. We make the world a better place. So how do we do that? With a little TLC. Technologically advanced weapons, loose morals, and a culture of conflict. Now let's take a step through each of those letters. Why are you watching that now? It's the orientation video. I know what it is. Why are you watching it now? 
Well, I mean, we're about to be shot at, so I figured it couldn't hurt to brush up on our healthcare package. If you weren't paying attention to the briefing, I don't think you'll live long enough for your copay to matter. So I should be reviewing the life insurance policy. You know, our job interview has a 5% mortality rate. Statistically, the odds were low that you would die before we hired you, but I allowed myself to be an optimist. Your parents should have treated you better. Yours should have treated you worse. All right, ladies and gentlemen, contrary to your colleague's demeanor, this is no laughing matter. The Nawali already took out one team that was sent to bring him in, and I want as many of us going home as possible. So stick to the plan, work together, and let's grab that son of a bitch and send him to the frontier. Let's get paid. Alpha team, go. First day on the job. Don't fuck up. Newbie, catch up. Right. Let's kick some. Holy shit. Turrets, take cover. Ah. That was close. Ah. Oh. Ah. Jesus Christ, it's my first fucking day. Shit. Anybody left? Me, I think. Figures. We have to rendezvous with Bravo team when we're dead. Keep pushing forward, I'll meet you there. Copy that. Welcome to the Daily Grind. Attack the Nuali! Uh. Uh. Gotta keep pushing forward. Hot out here. Marshal unit, prepare for airstrike. Shit, that helps. Hey, you! We gotta find. Fuck! Better hustle, newbie. Bravo team is ready to move in. I'm not exactly taking a coffee break here. Marshal scum! Oh, bite me. Point that shit somewhere else. Newbie, you still alive? You sound like you lost the pool. Fall in. We'll use this APC for cover. A rolling shield. Nice. Nah, I'm delighted you approved. Bailey, make a hole. Roger that. Now let's go! Through the breach. Go, go, go! This one's asking for Keep it up, team. Let them have it. Yeah! You guys fucked with the wrong multinational private military corporation. Fuck! Hey, this may be a weird time to ask, but do we get hazard pay? You get a performance bonus for outstanding work, if you survive to collect it. Got it. Just trying to understand the pay structure. Reno! Bailey, hold up! Marshal, clear the field! Yes, ma'am! I'm getting shot! Turn her down! Shit! Whoa, take the turret! I got it! I'm good with these! No, that's not... You are damn lucky we don't have time to argue. Ruby, <sighs> take out the RPG up top! Damn it, I said take out the RPG! See? Told you I was good with these! Just shut up and shoot! Uh. Oh! <sighs> Can 
Can you hear me? Anybody? Shit. Either they're all dead or there's no signal. Guess I should put Sean and find the Nuali myself. How did Marshall get this far? The things we do for rent. Ah! Eliminate the intruder! The Nawali wants them all dead! This one's asking for it! At least I don't have to wear a suit. Finally, end of the tunnel. Gwen, hello, do you read me? Newbie, you're still alive? Yeah, I hear that a lot. The Nawali's holed up in the saloon up ahead. Rendezvous with the rest of us so we can box him in. In a minute, I'm gonna clear out some goons first. I gave you an order. It's on my way. Besides, we don't want them coming up behind us later. Fine, but next time I give an order, the only words I want to hear are yes and ma'am. Got that? Uh, yes, ma'am. an honest living. Take out that barricade. Ha! Couldn't do that at my last job. Glad you could join us. Let's move. We gotta keep the Nawali hold up until Charlie team are. Surprise. Newbie, once we hit the saloon, you flank left while the rest of us hold the center. Flank? But I can. Yes, ma'am. Saloon's right around this bend. Get ready and remember the plan. Right, team, let's take it. Tag him and tag him. Newbie, I told you to flank left. 
No plan survives contact with the enemy. Because of my flanking. Uh huh. Now get in there and flush that son of a bitch out. What does it take for a man to be able to enjoy a quiet drink these days? Mr. Nawali, you're coming with me. You really think you have what it takes to bring me in? I mean, yeah. <laughs> Where are you fucking going? I said you're coming with me! Perhaps I don't respect your authority. Then respect this. You set one foot on those stairs. Holy shit! No, you goddamn don't! Give it up, Nawali! There's nowhere to hide! You're surrounded. Make it easy on yourself. What the? I can't find it. Never mind. Get back here and regroup. We've got the bastard bottled up with nowhere to run. We know he's in the saloon. He can't stay in there forever. What the fuck? Thanks for the ride. I'll see you around. We need air support now! Stand down! We don't got time for hero bullshit! Don't worry, I got this. Gwen, we've got a problem. Hang on, the cavalry's coming. Oh, shit. <sighs> Come out with your hands up. <laughs> Not today. Oh, fuck. Oh. oh.
much than brains. Goddamn right I do. You're too predictable. Am I? Tried. I'll give you that. Get your hands in the air. I caught him.
Well, you didn't die. All in all, not a bad start. Jesus Christ! You're not gonna last. Your pep talks need some work. This is for you. Performance bonus. Is this a joke? You, uh, you ribbon the rookie? What were you expecting? There's supposed to be a bonus based on exceptional performance. That's right. And if you had performed exceptionally, you would have seen a bonus. Oh, come on. Can you really look me in the eyes and say I didn't do well? I can look you in the eyes and say you didn't do what you were told. I saw a better way and I took it. And if you were in charge, it would have been an inspired decision. But you're not. I am. This is a warning. Fall in line or find a new job. Fall in line? What the fuck? No, what the actual fuck? What the actual goddamn fuck? What the actual goddamn motherfucking goddamn fuck? Crap. Crap, crap, crap. Crap, crap, shit, crap, goddamn fucking shit, crap, crap, son of a bitch ass, wipe, piss, wipe, crap, 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 and crap. I had to roam, so I picked up the phone. Got Ollie up to see what was going on. Fall in line. <sighs> Y'all, but I needed one more. Shahid had me covered with the hundred green bags. So we left Brooklyn and we made big tracks. Joe down the belt, got all the conduit. Came to a toll, we paid and went through it. Had no destination, we was on a quest. I leave laid in the back so he can get rest. Drove down the road for two days and a half. The sun had just risen on a dusty path. Just then a big You have three new messages. Hey, it's Kevin. I'm baking up a slamming congratulatory brunch for when you get home to celebrate your first day on the job. It's gonna be dope. Oh, and it's official. I'm gonna be spinning at that idols party I told you about, so hope you can come. DTYL. Hey there, it's Nina. So excited about your new gig. I thought you'd want to know. I, I heard back from the museum. Uh, they, they went with someone else for the junior art curator job, so... Looks like I'm still stuck with Los Panteros. Anyway, glad one of us had a good day at least. See you soon. Hey, it's Eli. Congrats on your first day as part of the workforce. Speaking of which, um, when you asked to borrow my copy of Be Your Own Boss, I assumed it was because you wanted to read it, not to level out the coffee table. So let's talk about that when you get back. Can't wait to hear about all the HR forms I'm sure you had to sign. Reality here, Shahi. Yo, tip man, you got what you need? I checked for keys and started to step. And what do you know, my wallet I forget. Yo, it was a brown wallet, had prop smokers, had my Jimmy hats. I gotta get it, man. Everything smells amazing, Kev. You know what would make it smell even better? Hey, man, if you want a $300 waffle maker, you can buy it with the exposure the idols pay you in. Don't expect us to chip in. 
I've told you before, the idols are trying to build a post-capitalist society where money is not a concept. Yeah? Then why don't you go run off and join the commune? I'm into showering. Are you gonna help me get the waffle maker or not? As an investor, I don't like wasting money. You're wearing a fucking bow tie. <sighs> okay, I will throw in 20 bucks for a waffle maker. Nina? Um, good for 10? Who helped you move your forged paintings last month? Fine, 15. What sort of waffle maker can I get for 35 bucks? Uh, presumably one that makes fucking waffles. Mm -hmm. Hey! <laughs> hey, the wage slave is back. How was your first day? Were the other mercenaries nice to you? You know, as far as hired killers go, I'd give them a seven. You look like you could use a mugmosa. Thanks, Eli. Seriously, how's the job? Eh, it's the murder business. The fundamentals don't change, just the uniform. I can tell you love it. Okay. I don't have to love it. I have to pay my student loans. Phew. <laughs> I'm in. So I'm guessing that means the pay's good. Uh, supposed to be. Got stiffed on my bonus today. Dude, what the fuck? Uh, I played a little fast and loose on the job and, uh, well, my CEO wasn't a fan. You gotta be kidding me. Swear to God, this lady walked right off the set of an 80s action movie. I was half expecting her to call me Rook and threaten to take my badge. Are we gonna make rent? We'll make rent. We just gotta be a little more creative. Last time we got creative, I got stabbed three times. Hey, it would have been four times if Nina and I hadn't shown up. It would have been zero times if you were on time. This is true. Look, this is really not a big deal. We just knock off a payday loan place. No one gives a shit if people rob those bastards. You have a job now. You could actually just take the loan. Eli, I don't do business with morally bankrupt companies. You work for Marshall. Brunch is a time for friends and mimosas, not debates on morality. All right, all right. Man, this is really fucking good, Kev. Thanks. I was worried I added too much pepper. Mm-mm. Mm. No, seriously, this is perfect. The only way this could be better is if you put on a fucking shirt. Dinner and a show, baby. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs>Okay, brunch is done, dishes are clean. Let's go rob a payday loan place. And you know how we should celebrate afterwards. Karaoke! Yes! So, Nina, are we taking your project car? Fuck no, I'm not risking my baby over rent. We're boosting cars from down the street. Ooh, can we take a hybrid? Eli, I love that you're worried about fuel efficiency, but I'm thinking acceleration is gonna matter more. Your carbon footprint always matters. Just take that yellow one. Kev, you case the place. What are we looking at? One guard out front and the owner at the till. He's a real scuzzbag. I want some kick a dog. So, you know, fuck that guy. There. Let's get psyched. Only you can oh, decide no. how you Not this crap again. Hey. Only What's you can choose Don't to yuck someone's to yum. That life throws your way. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. But to realize that power, there's something you need to do. You need to be your own boss. Be your own boss. That's right. Be your own boss. One of these days, I'm gonna get you to listen to music in the car. Roger McGillicuddy speaks the music of my soul. You are a different kind of cat, Eli. What can I say? The world is full of uninteresting people, and I'm not gonna be one of them. You got one of those for me? You really want one after last time? I am not the first person to accidentally shoot a friend by dropping a loaded... Yeah, okay, I don't need a gun. Good call. Showtime. So I made them watch while I broke their dad's... Ah, oh, shit. Walk away, or the phrase dead-end job gets literal. <gasps> I, I don't have much... We don't want your money, just his. Get out of here. You done fucked up. I've been getting that a lot lately. Where's the safe? If you're lucky, the cops will get to you before my people. <laughs> nice left. 
Been practicing. I can tell. Safe's back here. This guy had his password be a bunch of fives. Pick it up, Eli. I'm just saying, he could have at least made his work for it. Same plan as last time. Eli, Kev, pretend traffic laws matter and get the money home. Nina and I will split up and give the cops the runaround. Cool, let me get the McGillicuddy. No! Try to keep up this time. Yeah, yeah. See you at the switch. Time to beat it before the cops show up. Life is full of adversity and challenges. But oh, fuck no. I'm monitoring the police scanner. They're just responding to the call. Cops are now en route to the payday place. Sounds like they're out in force. Crap. Had time for a train. Guys, I got cops on my ass. Nina, don't wait for me. I gotta lose these guys. Try sideswiping them. It always works for me. Just let them get alongside you, and then bam, send them into a ditch. Yeah, going too slow. Try to hit their whole side, not just the bumper. You need speed for a good sideswipe. Fast enough to do any damage. You'll do more damage the faster you go. Another one down. Ha, that took care of them. How's everyone else? Eli and I made it home with the money. You ready for karaoke? Start warming up those voices. Nina, where you at? Just changed cars and headed home. Good. Headed to my switch car now. It was safe and sound at the junkyard a minute ago. That's pretty deep in Pantero's territory. Did you tell your gang you did that? Are you kidding me? If Sergio knew we were running a job on his turf, he would have taken a 90% cut. 90%? Good God. The man's either a monster or a capitalist genius. What? The fuck did you assholes do to my getaway car? Ain't your car if it's on our turf. Now you're gonna pay for parking. Let's get this asshole!
No one pulls a job here without Sergio. I don't have time for this shit today. The things I do to pay my rent. Problem. Los Pantero scrapped my switch car. Hey, what? Bigger problem. The police picked up that firefight at the junkyard. They're heading your way. Grab a bike and head off road. I'll pick you up in the desert. Damn. Sounds like no karaoke tonight. Every fucking time, man. I'm on my way. There's a trail that goes between the mesas. I'll meet you on the other side. Got it. Do I want to know what happened to the Panteros who stripped your car? Sorry, Nina. Self-defense. Fuck, I didn't want that to happen. Let's hope Sergio never finds out it was us. You free and clear yet? Not at all. I've got cops up the ass. I'll pick you up on the other side of the bridge. You didn't want to risk your car. I said I didn't want to risk it for rent. I'd risk anything for you, dummies. So, is this how it's gonna be every time we have to pay rent? I thought that went great. Yeah, okay. Maybe I can go back to running my old side hustles for extra cash? Don't worry. We'll figure it out. This town is full of opportunities, if you know where to look. Glad you made it home safe. We have to get better at this rent thing or we'll never get to do karaoke again. Also, we'll get evicted. Nina said you might go back to some of your old side hustles. I have some friends who might need work done in your area of expertise. When you say friends, do you mean friends, friends, or special friends? All my friends are special. I'll put their info on your map. I think you'll really like them. I'll like them fine as long as their money's good. Thanks, Kev. This is what I live for. Rent's paid and there's 
Not much left for groceries. We've been splitting the bills four ways. We're barely getting by. Did I tell you how badass that payday loan getaway was? Because it was badass. You and Nina, damn. You'll kick just as much ass on the side hustles. I know it. Can't complain about this. Fun is good. Must remember that. Oh, I like this. Graphic novel work? Oh, yes. My car's running great. Seem to enjoy our little billboard adventure. I just hope Sergio never finds out we pulled a job on Bandero's turf. Los Penteros will always be a part of this city. It's not okay! Los Pendejos.
Me gusta. Jackpot. Flash, Santo. Going to the dentist. Trying to be difficult it just comes naturally. I'm getting a record for this. I'm limping.
it comes in different. Go home down at the cemetery. Pay us a visit to the mortuary. Flash, Santo Ileso, an abandoned Wild West theme park, was the scene of a pitched gun battle as martial operatives faced off with the Nawali, a notorious assassin and smuggler, currently number seven on Interpol's most wanted list. Martial representatives would neither confirm nor deny they are now holding the Nawali at the frontier, the company's private detention facility. This has been Juana Villalobos, reporting for the Star Register News Network. taking me for my birthday.
Yo, I saw your post. What do you need? A no-good lowlife's been stealing cars around these parts. I demand vigilante justice. How can I exact that for you? I set aside a bait car for you. It is just her type. I'll go get it. Okay, I found the car. What's next? Next, we blow them sky high. I left a bomb for you to attach to the car. Now this is getting interesting. The bomb is on the car. Now to set the trap for this some bitch. Here's where you can park the car. Heading there now. The trap is set. I'll go wait across the street. She looks suspicious. The target's in the car. Shit, the remote's not working.
more car rustlers in my neighborhood, no sir. to work my way up the ladder. My diet can wait till tomorrow. Mama needs some french fries. You don't know anything. Welcome to the Jasinski Public Library. To learn more about Anthony M. Jasinski, developer of the Lakeshore Financial District, visit the nearby Jasinski Pavilion. Listen to every panel at both sites to win a prize. I need to get one of those new cars. Welcome to the Jasinski Public Library. To learn more about Anthony M. Jasinski, developer of the Lakeshore Financial District. <laughs>
Did you know? Santo Aleso purchased the building in 1958 for its main public library. Jasinski employed the same ingenious methods used by builders in his Did you know? Going. Before he disappeared at the age of 84, Jasinski... The Jasinski Public Library was completed in 1928. Congratulations, you have completed the Jasinski Public Library. That reminds me, I've got a library book overdue. responsible for what my face does when y'all talk.
kill me if I don't. Eight years ago? Goodbye. One meeting to another. It's not fair that I have to pay all the bills.
Newbie, I've assigned you a driver for your next job. Meet us at the rendezvous. I'll be right there. Coming at you with a listener request from Three Rice Make a Left saying, Give me some of that Marlo. So I'm gonna hit you with some future power sources. Listen up. Where is everyone? I didn't need everyone. Just you. Because I'm the only one who could get it done. Sure, let's go with that. Sergio, huh? You're familiar with Panteros? I mean, my roommate's one of them, so yeah. Oh, don't give me that look. Rent's expensive. Is this gonna be a problem? I mean, per the roommate code, I'm gonna have to fold her laundry for two weeks, but beyond that, I'm golden. What are they moving? Antiquities, mostly. The Nawali was waiting to sync up with them before he was captured. You mean before we captured him? I'm pretty sure you were about to die when I came along and saved your ass. And yet, if I hadn't stalled him, he would have got away. So, you're welcome. Do you want it to look like an accident or a statement? What? Well, I'm assuming you want me to make the convoy disappear. No, I want you to follow it. So I can kill everyone and retrieve the stolen goods. So we know where they're going. Sure, and then I kill everyone and retrieve the stolen goods. No. Then you will report back to me, I will arrive with the team, and you will go home and hit the showers before you have a chance to fuck it up. 
You think I can't do this? I think you like getting a paycheck. Follow the convoy. Don't fuck it up. Hey there. Name's JR. We about to see some action? Nope. Orders are to follow the convoy, observe its activity, and report back. Seriously? The convoy's right there. You know, I heard about you. I'm a little bit of a maverick myself. You crazy badasses like us, we're not gonna mix it up? No. My friends are counting on me to get my performance bonus. I can't afford to screw it up. We don't engage, just observe and report. Looks like them motorcycles are falling back. Probably just drop something. We're gonna just let them shoot at us? Gwen was very clear on not engaging. We don't do something? All we're gonna observe and report is getting dead. Fine, just this one. <laughs> That's how I like to ride. and report. Oh fuck, they have a turret. Can't take this kind of fire forever. Our orders are to follow them. No can do. Unless you want to take that thing out. I God damn it, get in closer. Wait, what are you doing? Taking out the turret. From the roof? No, from the truck. Get me closer. You're out of your goddamn mind. I thought you said you were a maverick. A little bit. I said a little bit. Oh! Order's harder than I thought. Heads up! We got more incoming! Ah, oh, come on! I was almost done! Well, as long as I'm here. Toby? Why am I seeing gunfire at the back of that convoy? Gwen? Well, there were motorcycles and then a turret, and one thing led to another. Well, that was cool. You don't sound mad. Did you honestly think I would send one car after a convoy that size? You're just a distraction. We got a drone following these motherfuckers. Wait, you use me as bait? That's the job you were born for. Mission accomplished. Now finish what you're doing and get out of there. That turret is giving them a taste of their own medicine. Ah!
I thought I ordered you to retreat. Honest to God, I am trying. Well, as distractions go, you're exceeding expectations. Great. Can you put that in my performance review? Kill that some bitch. Okay, time to finally get the fuck out of. What is that? Sandstorm. We're going in. Come in, newbie. Then radio. JR, let's get him. Kid gloves are off. The kid gloves were on? Oh, I can't get a clear shot. The main convoy ahead. Uh, we got a problem here. Be more specific. Sand's clogging up my intake. We're losing speed. Great. Just give me into jumping range and fall back. That's suicide. I got us this far, didn't I? I don't want to be a maverick no more. You going up again? Shit! Hurry! Connected by a hit? Oh. Uh. 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 
asshole off my rig! I got field command now, bags. When said to do what I need. Fuck with Sergio's business! You think you can walk away from that? Shit! We're out cover! I'm gonna hand Sergio your head! Hey, Gwen. I followed the convoy. It, uh... It stopped. You did good. Holy shit, a compliment. Yeah, yeah. Stay here. Over here. Now! Gwen says you were responsible for retrieving the Hummingbird Codex. If that was something in the truck, then yes. Impressive work. I wouldn't have been able to do it without JR, sir. Team player. I like that. There's someone I'd like you to meet. This is Dr. Antonio Espina. He's the chief curator for the Museum of Santo Aliso. It's nice to meet you, sir. The retrieval of these relics is no small feat. The museum is in Marshall's debt. Just doing my job, sir. Antonio's museum has a contract with Marshall, and he requested you to be in charge of security. What? Gwen's filled me in on your eccentricities, but the results speak for themselves. Sir, it's my second day. Sounds like someone wants to talk themselves out of a promotion. No, no, I want the job. I'm just surprised. Things change fast here at Marshall. So, can Antonio and I count on you or not? Yes, sir.
it's me, JR, from Marshall. I got a favor to ask if you got a minute. Might be a little something in it for you, too. Eh, I'm not doing anything else. Be right there. Hey, JR. What's up? Well, after that little clusterfuck we had with the Panteros, you know, when my life was flashing before my eyes, I started thinking about early retirement. Seems fair. Took my bonus and savings and bought this empty lot. I'm fixing to open my own garage. Trouble is, a pack of those idols anarchists made off with my shipment of car parts. Without it, my garage is gonna fail before it even opens. And you want me to get the shipment back? After our last run, I figure this should be easy. I'd make it worth your while. Say, a percentage of the garage? A percentage? I'm in. Hey, yo. Kev, quick question. The idols robbed this guy I know. Any idea where they take his stuff? Probably to the camp. This friend of yours some rich bigwig? Nope. Just a regular Joe trying to make ends meet. That doesn't sound right. The idols are about taking down the corrupt system, not the little guy. Yeah, and they never get overzealous. Well, just be careful, okay? The idols are like a family to me. I promise I'll be nice to them.
That must be the camp. The Collective really know how to throw a party. Who the hell are you? I'm, uh, looking to join. You. Idols. A new recruit? Well, come on in. Go find Cheryl, with a snake mask. She'll hook you up. Represent your crew with hot pink! Hi, Cheryl? I'm thinking about joining the Idols. Yeah! Ready to take down the establishment? Sure. By, like, stealing car parts and shit? Or by punching everybody in the neck till they choke! <laughs> but hey, you do you. The Idols are a big tent. You like heists? Talk to Martin. He's headbanging around somewhere. You, Martin? Heard you were a heist man. Fuck yeah! I made this botnet that hacks Wi-Fi-enabled refrigerators. Come summer, there won't be a working ice dispenser in town. Sounds great for the little guy. But do you steal real things? Like car parts? What even is real in a late-stage capitalist digital economy? Boom. Mind blown. But if you like meat space theft, talk to Timmy O. He's around somewhere working on his bike. Timmy O, I heard you bring in big hauls. Anything that ain't nailed down. Just boosted a shipment of car parts off some cog in the big auto machine. Crazy! Where would you even keep something like that? Warehouse and back, with the other refuse of materialism. Told Kev I'd try to play nice. Stop! What are you doing here? I heard you have some car parts I was hoping to take back. Fuck off! Thing is, they belong to one of the little guys you say you fight for, so... There are no little guys. Just idols and tools of the system. Tether that container and drag it back to JR.
Holy shit, you actually did it. Now I can finally build my garage. I always deliver on a job. Hang on. Kev, what's up? You said you'd be nice to them. I was. They were shitheads. Well, now they want you dead, and they're headed your way. Shit. Thanks for the heads up. JR, we got idols coming. Those some bitches are back. Time to beat some asses. You fucking lied to her! You drunk? Yeah. Get in on this! This is payback! Ha! We do the deal. Not you. Perfect. Glad that's over. Thanks for saving my business. No problem. Thanks for the percentage. Now all I need to do is build a garage. How's that gonna work? Just you watch. Here it is. The world premiere grand opening of Jim Rob's Garage. The service center has all the tools you need to customize your ride. And if you see a car out there with something you like, bring it on in. Now that we're in business, let's talk shop. Hey, JR, if we're short on parts, why don't we just steal them? We could run a little chop shop here. Now that would save us a pretty penny. I need some parts for a hammerhead. How about you get me one of those? Never listen to me. Oh, get it! I am not enjoying this. I should drive this over to Jim Robs. Jim 
Hammer Ops. Hey, JR, I got you a hammerhead. All right, just leave it there on the side. What else do you need? The idols have an off-road buggy they call the Desert Devil. Can you get that for me? I've seen them riding northeast of town around the mesas. If it's out there, I'll find it. This is fun! I'd use the internet to find my clients, but I think that's a felony. Bingo! So Cha-ching! Could this be any more stupid? Keep looking. I may do a trick. If I have to do one more oil change, I'm gonna lose my shit. I should ask my dad for a raise. Oh my god! Oh, oh, oh no! Oh no! Change up my vape flavor.
gala's about to start for the Hummingbird Codex unveiling. I want your security team in place. It's your night to shine. Surprise, surprise.
party this year. Sorry. What the fuck is this? Another beautiful day in Santa Elisa. I should do this more often. I deserve a raise. No. My lawyer says I probably won't serve any time. This part is really hard. Get this shit moving. Team, tonight's a big night, so nobody fuck it up. You, uh, Johnson, is the codex ready for its entrance? Roger that. It's in position, and the display case hover tech is green. Good. I love this tech. Thank you for coming here this I'm evening. gonna check in with the boss. We Antonio's speech honored. should be wrapping up. You could join us for this very special celebration. Now, Bravo, team. How's it hanging? Uh, fine. Dear place. I saw that! Just kidding. Ago, Relax. I was a young intern at the National Museum. And of course, thanks to each and every one of you. Your donations tonight will benefit the international effort to end illegal traffic of stolen antiquities. And now, please, enjoy yourselves. Mr. Marshall, how was your evening, sir? Fine, fine. But I don't see our guest of honor. Where's my hummingbird codex? They'll be escorting it in any moment. That's what I like to hear. Have you met Myra Starr? She's on the Marshall Board of Directors. How do you do, ma'am? Quite well. So, you're Atticus's new hotshot. That's what it says on my ID badge. Oh, talented and confident. Reminds me of a younger me. Now, nah, what say we celebrate? Go get yourself a drink. Yes, sir. Is it true the mayor will be here later? What do you think you'll do? You don't drink on duty. I'm following orders. Atticus told me to celebrate. <laughs> of course he did. You want a word of advice? Watch your step around Atticus. He only sees results. No problem. That's what I give him. Uh-huh. Hey, what happened to not drinking on duty? I'm not on duty. Hey, Nina, I can't talk. I'm working security. That's why I'm calling. Los Panteros are about to try to take the Codex back. What? Are you sure? Yes, I'm driving getaway. I'd have called sooner, but I wasn't alone. Fuck. When? Nina, get off your phone. We're going in. Shit. What the hell are Los Panteros doing here? I've got it under control. You glad you had that drink now? Maybe. Hey, Nina, I can't talk. I'm working security. That's why I'm calling. Los Panteros are about to try to take the Codex back. What? Are you sure? Yes, I'm driving getaway. I'd have called sooner, but I wasn't alone. Fuck. When? Nina, get off your phone. We're going in. Shit. What the hell are Los Panteros doing here? I've got it under control. You glad you had that drink now? Maybe. Three. 
increase the guard on the codex. God, I hope Nina's not in this mess. Where is my head of security? Right here, Mr. Marshall. Get this under control. It's an embarrassment to the company. Yes, sir. Shooting the artifact. Secure the codex. I'll get Atticus out of here. Hey, I'm in charge here. You get Atticus out of here. I'll secure the codex. Uh huh. No problem. Eyes on the codex. You nuts! That place is full of Panteros! It's faster. I can handle them. Pants and follow me. For your safety and security, please exit the building. Attention, 
Get the fuck away from there! Got the codex. I've secured Atticus. I need to find the rest of the board. I'll get the codex to the safe room. How the fuck do I move it? Your martial ID triggers the sensor. It'll move on its own as long as you stay close. Got it. Access granted. Emergency transport initiated. Cover systems re-engaging. Give my marshal, Will! Take that one. Reloading! Codex. Approaching the safe room. I need backup. This thing is getting buggy. The Codex is still up there. Fucking hover tech. Somebody report! I got separated from the Codex. Anyone have eyes on it? Negative! I got nothing! It's just chaos here! Damn it, the door's blocked. Need something to bust through that gate. Cool cannon. Dynamite! Ah, oh, shit, it's fake. Room's a dead end. Gunpowder? Replica. Damn it. Busted RPG? No fixing that. Rocket? Needs something to fire it with. I have an idea. Shit, that worked. Sergio? Let's go, motherfucker! Yes! When?
out of it. I need a meat shield. Whew. That is one big asshole. Gwen, you're alive. Don't celebrate yet. Sergio got away. I got most of the board locked down, but I can't find my response. Stop. Keep an eye out for her. We fight as one! Is that a fucking minigun? Oh god, it's you. Better find cover. I'll hold them off. You can come out, Miss Star. It's safe. Thank you. Thank you so much. You are really good at this. It's not my first time shooting up a place with a minigun, ma'am. Just the first time people are happy I did it. How the fuck did this happen? Shit. What's going on, sir? You. Sir, I know I made a little mess protecting the museum, but we have to look at the big picture. The threat's been neutralized, Mistar is safe, and, as you can see, the Codex is secure. A mess? Yes, there is a goddamn mess! I don't... I don't understand. Well, you were wasting time with her. The Idol stole the Codex and replaced it with a fake! Sir, I wasn't wasting time. I was saving... Do you think I give a shit if Myra Star lives or dies? Atticus. You are replaceable. You are replaceable. That was not. Sir, I can lead a team to retrieve the Codex. The hell you can. You're fired. What? You're done. If I see you on Marshall property again, I'll have you shot. We'll make this right, Antonio. I promise. Thank you. I am sorry. I just got word that the idols are planning on attacking the museum. Hey, it's Kev. I, uh, I made you breakfast if you want some. That's cool if you don't. Nina wasn't hungry either. Uh, uh. I'm sorry about last night. I didn't hear about the museum until it was too late to warn you. The Collective don't tell me shit. You should come to the Idols party with Eli and I later. Open bar? No? Mm. 
Okay, uh, I'm gonna go. Just, uh... Just know that Eli and I are worried about you guys. Later. Well, looks like we both got fucked over. Yeah. No work today? I'm leaving Sergio's group text on bread. Fair. Los Panteros have been going downhill since he started leading. We used to be about family. Now it's all about him. Plus, he's zero for two this week. That just makes him pissy. I want to eat my feelings. Oh, come the fuck on. God damn it. Stupid refurbished appliances. Figures. Cutting room, the premier auction experience for knife connoisseurs of all ages. Our first stop, Lung Piercer. A contemporary update on the classic Shiv, the Lung Piercer. Looks like we got a shopper in Santa Aliso that knows their stabbing implements. Let's bring out the next item. It's been a hell of a day here on the cutting room, but I've been saving the best for last. The Judas 3000. If Brutus had had one of these bad boys, he wouldn't have needed the Senate to help stab Caesar. How many knives did you end up buying? Not enough. Hey, Sergio just texted us. <sighs> he has to be pretty pissed. Yeah, says he's planning on attacking the idols party. Man, I'd hate to be the idols right now. Everyone at that party is probably gonna get killed. Sucks to be Kevin Eli. Yeah. Oh shit! We gotta go! They're not coming, are they? They'll get over it, man. Don't worry about it. <sighs> They're totally pissed at me. They'll get over it. Give them time. You mind if I get a drink? You do you, man. Can I have a white wine spritzer? Eli, are you okay? I, I, I don't think so. Get in and drive fast. Where's the party? The resort. We gotta move. Try to get a hold of Eli. I'm gonna call Kev. Come on, come on, come on. You picking up? Nothing. You? Yo, this Fuck. Is Kevin. We got voicemail. Same so here. Leave a message after I drop the beat. Wait for it. Wait for it. Kev, call me. I'm gonna call Sergio. Maybe I can put a stop to this. He'll never listen. It's worth a try. Well, look who decided to get back to me. 
Sergio, you gotta call this off. My friends are in there. I'm my friend you should be worried about. You are taking Los Panteros to war just because you think Marshall and the Idols embarrassed you. You're saying some shit you're gonna regret, Nina. Call it off or I quit. You ain't gonna quit. Try me. Put it on speaker. Kev, you all right? I'm fine, but Eli- They fucking shot me! You're doing great, Eli. Stay cool. Where are you guys? Eli's behind the bar. I'm keeping him covered. Nina and I are on our way. Keep Eli alive. Got it. Please don't hang up. Eli, listen to me. Nina and I are gonna kill every motherfucker standing between us and you. And that means we're gonna need both hands, okay? Okay. You're gonna be fine. I promise. Panteros group chat is blowing up. They set up roadblocks on the bridges. We're gonna have to go through your crew, Nina. Panteros aren't my crew anymore. Eli and Kev are all that matters. The last thing I said to Eli was, I'll be late on rent. The last thing I said to Kevin was, ugh. You ready? Let's get our boys back home. They're here. We're gonna get you out, but you'll have to walk. Oh. I'll, I'll try. Shit. Shit? Shit what? What now? Los Panteros should have left the party crashing to the experts. Looks like you're gonna back the fuck off. No, 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 no! They're cool, they're with me. If they're with you, then you get to kill them. I guess this is my last night. You don't need this fucking cult anyway. What she said. Let's finish what you started and get Eli out of here. Yes, please. Come on, 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 come on,
Let's go. Oh man, we're in the shit now. We just pissed off the idols and Los Fonteros. Yeah, big time. So let's not stick around until they come back. Agreed, let's move. And this time I'm driving. Acceleration. Oh, what about the gas mileage? Fuck the gas mileage! After us. That's it. I've had enough for one day. Keep driving. I'm gonna teach these fuckers a lesson. You sure? You got them coming up fast. Well, I got an RPG and some shit to work out. So let's see how that goes for them. Yes, I want. I don't wanna die before I make my first million. I'm not gonna die. I got you, buddy. Book. It always calms him down. Oh, not this again. Hey, I can use some positivity right now. Turn it up. And power that the world wants you to know. Real. That's right. Your own of your job, of your happiness, of your life. You don't see me. I'm out! You're selling hours of your life away for 15 bucks a piece. So what do I say to the person who wants to get paid what they deserve? Oh, fuck! I run it like a boat! Be your own boss. Every turn makes it hurt worse. Stay and with us, Eli. Love us out of this. But if you want to learn from your mistakes, instead of getting punished for someone else's, what are you going to do? These fuckers are relentless. Have insurance. I don't really care. You would if you saw what they charged to fix a flesh wound. Kev, where's the hall closet, Yo, top shelf? Okay, this is gonna suck, buddy. Oh fuck! You're doing great. You're being very brave. Fuck you. Hey, keep talking to Kev like that, and you won't get a star on the star chart. <laughs> Ow! Oh, what are we gonna do? Finish sewing you up. Yeah, and then what? The idols and Panteros aren't exactly our number one fans right now. Isn't that obvious? We're starting a criminal empire. What? Your car was right, Eli. About everything. Yeah, what the fuck is happening? Guys, we're really good at what we do. So why are we doing it for other people and not ourselves? I mean, you know how to start a business. Kev knows how to get attention. <laughs> I'm a walking murder party. And Nina? Nina's the best goddamn driver in the business. Who could touch us? 
Hell, we just took on two crews at once and walked away just fine. I was shot. And you're getting a sticker, so quit bitching. I'm in. Fuck yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Eli? Guys, this is a little crazy. What happened to there being a difference between surviving and thriving? Well, I survived being shot, and now I want to thrive without being shot again. Nina's down. Kev's down. Snickerdoodle is definitely down. Oh, do not bring her into this. Eli, this cat suffers no fools. And neither should you. Uh. <sighs> is that a yes? Yeah, it's a yes. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started. I'd love to get another cat, but Snickerdoodle said no. This whole criminal venture thing? I don't know. I kind of thought I'd get my start in something more legit, you know? But don't worry. I'm in. I wish I could say I can't fucking believe Sergio, but I can absolutely fucking believe Sergio. I'm glad to be done with him. And Los Panteros. Let's get going with our own thing, huh? They can have my Oxford comma when they pry from my cold, dead, and... Should I try to get graphic novel work? I'm fucking funk. I'm actually enjoying myself.
Now you need me. Finders keepers. Well done. I can't stand this. It's mine oh. now. That's cool. Looky here. should run for city council. Just what I wanted. That's what you think. Miss out on a good photo op. Twenty years of this, and I can retire with a pension. Let's get this back to JR. Obliged. What's next? How about an attrazione? That's not an easy car to find. Well, it just so happens I got a particular one in mind. 
belongs to Levi Marshall. Marshall as an Atticus? His nephew. That little turd caused me grief to no end during his summer internship. He's a student at that fancy art school in Marina del Lago. Gotcha. I'll check the parking lot next time I'm over there. Los Panteros are the heart and soul of Santo Ileso. That was Nighthawk by Glastonbury Rants. and you're listening to KFADR 101.1 Outrun. Running out the clock with a celebration of Synthwave. Eh, nobody cares about those. To drive this over to Jim Robs. Nice hit there. the city. Nice hit there. I knew 
luck? Here you go. Not even a scratch. That's what I like to hear. How about finding me a go-kart? Seriously? Serious as a grave. Well, there's a car track over in El Dorado. I'll check around there. Can you give me lucky number seven? It's got the kneecappers. Lucky number seven, huh? I'll see what I can do. I swear, I swear I she was in <laughs> Hey, just a reminder, we're having our first company meeting in a bit. Don't be late. Company meeting. Nice euphemism. I'll be right there. I don't know, guys. What do you think? I feel like there's a lot we're missing. There is, but it's enough to go on for now. What about criminals? Don't we kind of need more than three if we want to call this thing an empire? There's four of us. Oh, are you planning on shooting anyone? After that party, I think I'll stick to metaphorical blood on my hands. Yeah, that's less useful when people try to kill us. Nina's right. We need more people. We'll look more legit if we have a home base. Are you saying we're not legit already? Oh, I love you, but I'm allergic. <clears throat> yeah, point taken. All right, let's brainstorm. What would our place need? I gotta be able to host some parties and have more than a fucking galley kitchen to work with. I wanna be able to set up a proper garage to work in. I don't think Sergio's gonna be letting me near the forge anytime soon. That's good. What you got? I don't know, a ball pit? I'm joking. Kind of. I'm kind of joking. It needs to be defensible. We pissed off a lot of people, and let's not kid ourselves. They're gonna try to kill us. You're fun. Hey, man. Just being real. For me? We need it to be cheap. We don't have a lot of cash, so... We'll probably be looking at a fixer-upper. 
So we need an open space for the interior, a decent plot of land to build a garage. It's got to hold up in a firefight and it's got to be dirt cheap. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. It's going to be a bitch finding. I got it. Holy shit, we are so good at this. There's an old church near Fort Cullen. The sanctuary is huge. I can turn the rectory into a garage. It's condemned, so it's cheap. And it's got a fucking graveyard, so we can stash the bodies. You fucking rock. What are we waiting for? Let's check this place out. Let's go. I'll drive. Where is this church? Up on 3rd. Oh, that place. Look at these pictures. The architectural details look amazing. Let me see. Nina, this place is in ruins. I said it was a fixer-upper. There's a fine line between fixer-upper and money pit. Relax. The listing says it's being restored by a developer, John Bland. John Bland? The real estate king of Santo Elisa? Is he the guy on all those billboards? Why does a guy that into self-promotion stick with a name like Bland? Bland is no Roger McGillicott. It does restore the place, and we can still get it to shoot. It might work out. Assuming the restorations preserve the original facade. You're not gonna worry about preservation when I put in my state-of-the-art kitchen, are you? We can discuss that later. heavy equipment for a renovation. Looks more like a demolition crew. He's gonna restore this place in the condos. Not if we do something about it. No one who wants to demo a demo crew. You have been listening to The Merry Wives of Windsor, composed by Otto Nikolai. contract with them for security. Oh, fuck. Hang tight. I'll take care of them. Perfect hit.
That's the last of them. Damn. Sounds like the drivetrain overheated. Guess it wasn't designed with you in mind. Marshall's down, but they'll be back as long as Bland owns the deed to the property. Then let's get him to sell. After this? Not likely. It'll shake him down and make him hand it over. The idols used to do stuff like that all the time. Good call. Kev, you're with me. Where's Bland even at? Uh, let's call the number on those billboards and find out. Bland here. One sec. Mr. Mayor, been an honor talking to you. Sounds like he's at City Hall. All right, who's this? Mr. Bland, I'm calling to take that old mission church off your hands. Huh? Wait, are you the asshole who just wrecked my demolition site? Listen, fuck nut, you set foot on one of my properties again, I'll make sure you can't buy so much as a tool shed in this town. Well, that was uncalled for. Eh, let's go take his ass for a little ride. Put this to good use. Look what I found. It's my lucky day. That'll do. Hey, hey. Is that him in that car? Mm, same dickish face as the billboards. You got insurance, right? Hi there, me again. You gonna make this easy and give me the deed to the church? You? Go fuck yourself. Bad answer, John. I hope you don't get car sick. Let's show this shitbag a little Santo Eliso drift.
taking me? I told you to play hardball in traffic. Look out! How you do business? That's right, man. We're local. Just give us the deed. No. Guess the ride's not over yet. John, you're not leaving here unless we get what we want. Think you can handle a little air time? is 97.9 KNUUK. Hey, don't slow down. Dude might try to jump out. doing business with you. This car is also ours now too, so get the fuck out. That worked great. We got the deed and a briefcase. Yeah, plus we blew up some shit, did some sick drifts, and uh, stole the church. All in a day's work. Ready to head home? Home? I like the sound of that. Ooh, I'm gonna post about it. Yada yada da, yada da da. Hashtag take me to church, hashtag new digs in this, hashtag and post it. Oh look, I already got a like. Seriously? How many followers do you have there? DJ Kev has his fans. Marshall backed up. You get the deed? Yep, we got the dude's whole briefcase. Let's get inside. You got the keys? Keys? No, just the briefcase. No problem. I'm sure I can get in through a window or something and open it up. Why don't we just break down a door? Uh, not my door. Whoa, calm down, Dad. Do you know how much a door costs? We own this place. We have to pay for that shit.
Nina was right. This place is awesome. Hey, check it out. Cool graveyard. Yeah. Hang on, I'm getting a call. Oh, shit. You better hear this. Hi, Cavi. We saw your post. Congrats on the new dicks. We adore your takedown of that gentrifying dick. Who is that? The Collective. The idols want to throw you a housewarming party. Fuck. Their parties get violent. No thanks. I wasn't asking. Duh. <laughs> See you soon, Kevin. Uh... I'll get the door. Hang tight. We've got company coming. Have you seen what's in the briefcase? Not now, Eli. Get in shot. And maybe revisit your stance on guns. Some backup in the graveyard. I'm coming, Kev. of a housewarming. Guess all that's left to do is check out the new digs. Yeah, okay. Dead bodies notwithstanding, this place is pretty great. Right? There's a lot of potential here. A lot of work to do, but still... We're actually gonna do this, aren't we? You got damn right we are. At least we've got a cool logo. I'll take it off the whiteboard. We need a name. The Saints. We call ourselves the Saints.
So, how you been? 